We got a great northern Minnesota hunt for you today. This is coming from Becker County. Uh, Nicole is out for opening weekend and smokes a giant. She's up there with her fiance Seth uh, on the family farm. They got 160 acres in Becker County and for years now they've been quality deer managing, okay? They've been passing the small bucks and the big ones are starting to show up. Last year, Seth smoked a giant. Check out this deer. Nicole also last year on her second hunt of the year shot this guy. They've been having tremendous success up there, seeing a lot of good deer. The benefits of the QDM are starting to pay off, and today we're gonna to show you exactly what I'm talking about. Check out this hunt. Up in northern Minnesota at our farm and we're sitting in a box stand here. We've got grass cut for about 30 yards out in front of us and then corn and beans out here. Earlier this week the temperatures were up in the 90s. It was pretty hot and they just cooled down. Uh, now we're looking at temperatures in the 50s and 60s so we're really hoping for some deer movement tonight. Expecting to see quite a few doe out here in front of us and Maybe get lucky and see a big buck walk by and uh, hopefully we have some good luck tonight. So stay tuned. Introducing the new Phase Body Odor System by Illusion. Phase out your human odor and start experiencing results like this. Phase is one of the most safe and effective scent control systems and its environmentally friendly formula was designed for use on sensitive skin. Z technology permanently entraps odor molecules on contact. Top industry professionals choose the Phase Body Odor System for a reason. It works. Order now at illusionsystems.com. So we only had about three or four trail cam photos of this deer through the summer. Uh, didn't have much of a pattern or any consistency. We weren't sure where the deer was coming from, but figured since it was early season, he'd be looking for food. So we sat over a mixture of brassica, soybean, and corn. Uh, figured it'd give us our best opportunity at seeing this deer. Needless to say, uh, we weren't expecting what we were about ready to see. As the night went on, we had about seven or eight does out in the field, um, and I noticed one looking off towards the woods. Uh, turned to look to see what she was looking at, and I could not believe what I saw coming out of the woods. It was just this big old rack, and I couldn't believe it. Oh, you fuck. Get another arrow. Get another arrow. Get another arrow. <sighs> Babe, what do you think? Oh, that was a rush. <laughs> it's amazing. Holy crap. I this, can't believe I got him. <laughs> this is her first sit of the year. We're after a deer that we've got, what, maybe six pictures of? Last year, she said, her first year bow hunting, said, Two sits and shot a nice, awesome buck. No, she sits one sit this year and kills us deer. Unbelievable. He's down. Oh. Get behind him here. Oh, hold that 
beautiful. I can't believe this happened. Oh, yeah. Unbelievable. It's just oh, an yeah. awesome, beautiful creature. Look at this thing. <laughs> well, congratulations to Nicole. That's a great deer. Uh, just an incredible opening weekend uh, and a beautiful deer. Uh, good luck to Seth the rest of the year. Uh, these guys got a great piece of property up there. And uh, it started with 160 acres and then the neighbors started catching on. Now in total, I think it's about 2,000 acres up there. And uh, some of their neighbors are shooting great deer. Just a lot of fun. Uh, just shows you a little bit of QDMA can go a long way. So next time you see that small buck, just think about passing up. Think about what it could be next year so well good luck to everybody this year uh we're heading to missouri tomorrow so a bunch of us will be down there chasing some deer northeastern missouri should be a good time then we come back be hunting in wisconsin and minnesota uh, hoping to get it done we've got a couple good weeks coming up here it's that time of year so get in the stand this is when it happens